Now we had some hints from Earth-based observations that Neptune had a few clouds and at least that was better than Uranus. But we really weren't prepared for the spectacular weather activity that uh, Voyager found. In fact, Neptune is the windiest planet in the solar system and I was totally unprepared for that. The winds are 325 meters per second. That's the speed that the great dark spot is moving relative to the inside of Neptune. Everything's going to the east, but the great dark spot is going more slowly to the east than the inside of Neptune. We had expected, because Neptune does, is not tipped on its side as a planet, but is an upright planet, that the magnetic field axis with axis would be aligned with the rotation axis. That is, the poles would be near the rotational pole. We were surprised again. The magnetic field is tilted by 47 degrees in the case of Neptune, and its center of the magnetic field is offset by almost two-thirds of the radius of the planet. Its magnetic field is somewhat weaker, only about half of that of Saturn's, for instance, at the surface, uh, and its magnetic field extends only about 400,000 miles from its surface. We did uh, discover that the rotation period of the magnetic field uh, is about uh, 16 and, uh, hours and 7 minutes, faster than Uranus, but slower than both Jupiter and Saturn.